Welcome to Miniorange. Miniorange provides single sign-on solution for Bitbucket, and as we know that is the best OAuth, and OpenID SSO solution available in the market. So in this video, we are going to set up Bitbucket single sign-on with custom OAuth provider. Let's get started with the setup. We are going to take Miniorange as an example to show the steps to configure OAuth provider. Go to the Bitbucket dashboard and click on the setting icon on the top right corner. Scroll down, and click on Find New Apps. You can search here for add-ons in Atlassian Marketplace. In the search bar, type OAuth OpenID SSO, and press Enter. To download the plugin, click on the free trial. Click on Accept and Install, to agree with Miniorange policy and terms of use. After successful installation, use the license key to activate the plugin. After activation of license key, click on Miniorange OAuth Client. In the Configure OAuth tab, select Custom OAuth App. You can view the setup guide of the plugin. Here you will get step-by-step -step instructions. So firstly, we are configuring Miniorange's Custom OAuth Provider. In the App section, we are creating new Bitbucket OAuth App. You will find redirect URI in the plugin, which is used to tell the OAuth Provider where to send the token after authentication. Copy it. And paste it in the given field. Save the application. App is configured successfully. Now, let's set up Bitbucket as OAuth client. In the Configure OAuth tab. Enter the app name. You will find the client ID, and client secret in the application that you created in your IDP. Copy the client ID, and paste it in the client ID in the plugin. Click here to reveal the client secret. Copy the client secret from the application, and paste it in the plugin. In the application, scroll down to check the scopes of the application. Enter the scopes. From the application, copy the authorization endpoint. And paste it in the authorize endpoint in the plugin. Copy the token endpoint, and paste it in the access token endpoint. Similarly copy the user info endpoint, and paste it in get user info endpoint. Fetch groups endpoint, and logout endpoint are optional. You need to select state parameter. The state parameter is an extra parameter, sent in the authorization request to protect against XSRF attack. This parameter is required by the Minior and OAuth provider. You can enable this field based on your custom OAuth provider. Click on save. You will get the OAuth settings updated message. Scroll down, and click on Test Configuration. You can see the successful test configuration here, along with the first name, last name, and email ID. Now, you will see the SSO button on the Bitbucket login page. Click on Use OAuth Login button. Here you will be redirected to OAuth Provider login page. Now, log in with your OAuth Provider credentials. You will be successfully logged into your Bitbucket dashboard using custom IDP credentials. Go to the user profile, to check the user data. And you can find the user's email ID here. Miniorange provides best single sign-on solutions, thanks for watching.